Work-life balance starts with me, meaning it's up to me to control my work-life balance. And quite often we get sucked into, you know, working too much. Um, so what can you do? Uh, notifications. Make sure you pay attention to the notifications you're getting. If you're getting stuff during supper and it's taking you away from your family, is that really a good thing? Uh, if you're getting up first thing in the morning, 6 a.m., 7 a.m., and looking at work, is that really the best thing for you? Are you going to pay for that later on in life? So uh, take a look at all your notifications. Uh, take a look at each of your apps that are popping up. If it's Teams, you can set quiet days and quiet hours so you don't get uh, alerted before you start work or you don't get alerted on the weekends. And that you will be a better person uh, for taking a break away from work. So pay attention to notifications. Also, uh, what are you getting alerted on in social media? If you like goofy videos of whatever, you're going to get more goofy videos. If you like stupid videos of some guy doing stuff about a Microsoft 365, you'll get more of them. Conversely, if you don't like them, you won't get them. Uh, you know, uh, I, you know, I try and put out content people like, I realize not everyone's going to like all this stuff. So I delete lots of it. So, so be thankful if you don't like all my stuff because you're not getting a bunch of it. So pay attention to what you're liking and not liking in life. And, you know, that'll really, uh, influence what you get. Uh, you know, it's so easy to go to ra down a rabbit hole uh, watching YouTube videos on uh, the X Factor or oh, like cars. Like fancy. Apparently, I like fancy cars. I drive a minivan, which is kind of funny. So we are what our phones show us. And if that bothers you, I guess it's time to make a change. All right. Hope you're having a good day.